this week, our tailgate of the week features some familiar faces to the LSU football program. We have two former players, including Eric Hill. Now, Eric, everybody here won the behind the scenes CST game day experience. Explain to me exactly what that is. Well, I guess it was a silent auction item that uh, our C, uh, CFO, uh, Jim Harp, uh, he um, put his uh, name in the hat and we end up winning Hornbeck. So uh, uh, brought uh, Captain Ron. He uh, operates the, uh, the Kimasabi, the uh, Hornbeck yacht. We have Harris Kale. He works in uh, sales with Hornbeck and uh, we're crashing Daryl McCorvey's uh, tailgate. So I, I needed a tailgate to get involved. So I called the, called the right man. Now, Daryl, it's a big game to tailgate for here for the Tigers, especially with new head coach Ed Ogeron coming out onto the field. How excited are you to see that today? I think we're very excited from a player standpoint, particularly as alumni. You know, we want the best for our program. And, you know, there's, there's mixed feelings on either way with the less situation. But I think we're all united on the idea that LSU football needs to become a dominant power again. And Coach Ogeron is also a former player, too. So he has a lot of support among uh, amongst the the alumni. So we're just excited, and we're here to witness the new era unfold today, and, and we're hoping that it's a big win for the program. Lots of excitement here on campus. We've got the tailgate. It's also homecoming, which you know we've got a lot going on here so far at LSU this week. So Harris, it's also kind of a homecoming for Coach Ogeron, and you all are from the same neck of the woods. How excited are you to see a Lafouche resident up here? Pretty excited, and I think I can speak for most of Lafouche Parish that uh, we're excited to have Coach Ogeron come back as a head coach, and uh, we wish him the best of luck. Now, will you be doing any type of translating, maybe for your buddies here, the fans in the stand, you know, if they don't maybe get that Coach O accent? We do have a, a distinct accent. I, I don't hear it, but a lot of people say we talk different, but <laughs> I, I can understand them perfect. They don't think you talk different at all. I can no. see it. Okay, now, Daryl, you have this RV each and every Saturday. Why do you keep coming out here to, to support your Tigers? Well, you know, like I said, uh, being an alumni and also a fan of college football, I mean, I can't think of a better place to be on Saturday, particularly when the Tigers are playing. The RV is to facilitate, you know, my friends and my family coming together, having a nice place to fellowship, get out of the heat when need be, uh, have some nice refreshments, and eat some good Louisiana food. Okay, sounds like a great day out here. Now, we're not going to leave Captain Ronnie out. Captain Ronnie, how excited are you to be able to do this behind-the-scenes CST experience and read on the Tigers? I was very excited to get a text message this morning because normally I'd be out, out catching tuna today, but if I can't catch tuna, I want to catch the Tigers here in Baton Rouge. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is perfect. Guys, thank you so much for letting me come along yeah. and see the tailgate. And Gordy and all you guys back there, they'll be heading to you all next.